Hi, beginner chess players. This is Doran Goodkind, and I am a good and kind person. And yes, Goodkind is really my last name. I like to create chess puzzles for you guys, and I would like to share one of the puzzles with you. So here is the question right now: Which pawn should capture this bishop? You can take, you can capture the bishop with. This pawn or this pawn. Please pause this video to think about it and after you think about it please unpause the video and then I will give you the answer. Okay. Okay so I hope that you pause the video and thought about what the correct answer should be and now I'm going to give you the correct answer. You should capture this bishop right here with the e4 pawn to avoid losing material. Why is it a mistake to capture the bishop with this pawn? The reason why is because if this pawn does take the bishop, then this rook can safely capture um, this knight for free. And this is not good for white because white just lost a knight for nothing, for no good reason, so that's not good. We, of course, again, we want to take the bishop um, with the e4 pawn because, again, when that happens, notice that this bishop, it is protecting the knight, and if the rook does take the knight, then that wouldn't be a good trade because, again, the bishop is worth three points and then the rook is worth five points. So that wouldn't be a good um, trade for black. So, again, the answer is let's capture the bishop with the e4 pawn to avoid losing material. Let me know what you thought about this video by commenting below. And if you like watching my videos, please subscribe to my channel. I strive to upload a video every single day, so please come back tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching.